What's up guys, it's Gary with Fresh From The Farm Fungi here in Denver, Colorado, and I wanted to do um, my final post on the Cordyceps 2.0. So out of about 36 um, rice containers, we got maybe a dozen or more that were pretty nice fruits. I would say that overall, I think the genetics really matter. Um, shout out to Terrestrial Fungi. We got some of his genetics and then the wild UK Cordyceps are kind of late to the pinning, but it seems like they're gonna be, you know, a good yield or two. Um, my thoughts on growing Cordyceps, I've been trying to do it for about two years now and it is very humbling. Um, it's not like any other mushroom out there. So, you know, dialing in your techniques is really important. And I think next I'm going to really focus on controlling the temperature and the lighting a lot more. I kind of just fruited these in the ambient light here. And, you know, my house changes in temperature a little bit, which I think slowed down um, their growth. But honestly, it looks like there's a bunch of more pins going in this one. I'm gonna harvest a few of these mushrooms and make myself some cordyceps tea. And um, I'm gonna let the rest of them, you know, grow out. And we'll have a few dried cordyceps. And my plan is to scale up the production. Um, probably gonna get some, you know, more fresh genetics and take some ascospores from these and cross them with the wild strain. So hopefully I can get some cool hybrids. But um, yeah, so thanks for watching our Cordyceps videos. I'll probably continue it once I um, kind of start scaling up, but I'm preparing for my farmer's market season and um, I might be doing like a large batch of these in the near future. So give us a thumbs up if you enjoy our videos. Subscribe if you're looking forward to more mycology videos like these. Stay tuned for Gardening with Fungi um, starting in the springtime and check out our Etsy Fresh Fungi for liquid cultures and petri dish cultures and other merchandise. Um, we should be having some dried cordyceps up there. Maybe um, it's a very limited supply. So um, check out our, our Etsy Fresh Fungi. And until next time, much love.